Hey you guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is a video that was very close to my heart and I love it so much. Um, I painted my little baby girl's ultrasound picture and um, this was like my favorite ultrasound picture because her little feet were crossed and I think this is, this was before we found out she was a girl, the ultrasound, but I painted it after I found out she was a girl i think i don't know how far along that was i'm not sure but uh, this process was like super fun for me it was super intimate it was a way to bond with my baby before she was even here um just make memories and all that other stuff so um i really hope you guys enjoy and let me know if you want to see more things like this i have drawn her digitally i want to do a little portrait of her um painting wise but yeah this was just like this sketch was just everything i loved i loved happy colors i love her clouds little sparkles hearts um it all just came together really well in my eyes like I don't even know what concept I had in mind. I was just, you know, rolling. I had a Pinterest pulled up, but I look at a lot of things when it comes to Pinterest. And don't mind me, I was pregnant, so I was going to eat, okay? My little vegetables. Period. It was good. Look at that. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, I'll probably pop in to tell you guys like what I'm using, how I painted it. All the other stuff. She's trying to bite my arm right now as I'm <laughs> as I'm talking. So yeah, um, can you? That hurted. Um, now you're pinching me. But yeah, I'll let you guys know the process that I had, what things I used, um, and yeah, you guys get to see my pregnant belly later on in the video. So. Please, please, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to check in with y'all to see if y'all have subscribed later on. Okay? I'm going to check in. Because at this point, like, how are you not? But yeah, hope you guys enjoy. And here's the process.
Okay, so this was the final sketch and I went ahead and started going in with um, these paint markers, these acrylic paint markers that I found on Amazon. Just started blocking in some color. Uh, a lot of the colors were pretty good. Um, this was my first time like really using them in a piece. Um, I haven't used them since because I've just been so busy being a mom. I haven't really gotten to do a lot, so yeah. Um, with these, I wouldn't do like really rough sketches with them. I would try to use them when you have like a minimal sketch that's already established. That's the, the best way to use it. Okay, here is where I started to kind of freestyle things. Um, with some of these markers, like with this color in particular, I had to layer it up um, to get some cleaner lines on this design. Instead of painting, um, I decided to line it with the liner pen with the little microns. And then I just kept going. Like, I didn't really have... I feel like where it comes to like the technique part of these markers, you really can't have none. They're not regular markers, so they don't like sink into the paper or ink, whatever the case is, but yeah, they kind of sit on top like paint. Oh, and that's the dog. But yeah, um, I found myself erasing a lot before I put paint down. So, there's a tip for you. <laughs>
Okay, hold up. Are you not subscribed yet? Or like liking or commenting or whatever? Take this moment and go ahead and do that. And then continue on with the video, okay? Love you guys. Also, I wanted to just pop in real quick like I have been doing and let you guys know which paint I was using. I'm using Angelus Black, uh, like the leather paints. It's honestly just so smooth and pigmented as a paint, like as a black paint, as a cartoony type pop art artist. I love this paint for lining stuff. So. Um, I don't know which paintbrush this is because my paintbrushes are so worn down that I can't see what they are anymore. But it's just like a small liner brush. Um, yeah, that's how I paint these lines. I feel like it just brings everything together. I'm sorry if you hear the battery in the background. I've changed that so many times. Um, it just brings everything together. I love lining stuff and yeah, that's just my comfort zone. Um, I'm gonna get into how I painted the piece after. I don't know. Shit. Just keep watching the video. Bye. Y'all, look at my tummy wummy and my little baby wavy in there. Isn't that crazy? It's just, it was just wild to paint this. Look at me breathing and stuff and my tank top coming up. I'm crying. Um, but yeah, I just did a quick little uh, background. I did it in pink because I knew that was a little baby. And um, I was trying to block in the mid-tones first. Um, just in case I mess up or whatever, it would be better. But yeah, I painted this little ultrasound picture. I had it up in front of me. You can see it right there. And I just sat down and did it. You know, it was pretty fun. 
Um, right now I'm putting in the highlights because as an ultrasound there's really not much. It's a black and gray picture and it's not really like super detailed or I mean they can be detailed but you know this was one of the earlier stages one and you know I just did what I needed to do. I put the highlights in and then I put in more of the um, the shadows just in case I needed to clean it up. See right here boom 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 boom. <laughs> And yeah, this was honestly the best part. This brought everything together, you know, and that that was it. Like, it was just, it was crazy to finish it and to see it. Like, I get chills. But oh, I was 19 weeks and six days at the ultrasound, so. Yeah, it was, it, I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Love y'all. Continue to show support. Um, and I'll make more videos. Bye. Thank you.